Hi, I uh, received a beeper that there has been an emergency on the workplace. Okay. I have everything I need with me here. I'm uh, a little new at this job, but don't worry, I'm taking it very, very seriously. Okay, so, uh, first, sorry, can I get your name? Okay, I see you have a badge there, is it okay if I take that? I'm just gonna put my back down. Look at this. Okay, I'm just gonna move it here. Okay, this does look like you, yep. Sorry, gotta follow protocol. I don't want to miss any steps. Okay, yeah. Yeah, that looks like you. That's handy. Okay. I'll save that for later. Um, well, it's nice meeting you. I'm Sherry. Um, okay. I see you have a cut there. I'll just, uh, Pull out the protocol for that, if that's okay. Let's look in this bag. Okay. Yeah, Sherry's on it. Cherry's on it. Yes. So why can't protocol be pretty? gonna leave for here and uh, find the protocols for a cut at the workplace. Awesome, I've got my checklist here. That's perfect. Just put this back. Were you having a good day so far? Yeah, before the cut, I mean. need for now. Okay. I just have my gloves, uh, my glasses here. Because I just want you to know that I'm taking this very seriously that you have a cut. Really, so that I give you your best care that you deserve. And the sooner you are healed and protected, the sooner you can return to work. Which means I'm doing my job. Can 
can you hold your arm up for me? Can you hold your arm up just kind of by your face if that's okay? Can you hold it up for me? I'm just gonna take it. Oh, okay. Um, because we are in the workplace and we kind of have some limited supplies. Without uh, taking you into my office, my uh, my place here, I'm just gonna. What I've got here is a hydrogen peroxide, which we're gonna spray on your cut. Just give it a good shake. Very still for me, if that's okay. Sorry, just a little more. clean now. The cut should be clean because we want to minimize the risk of infection. Oh. And I have some band-aids here. Can I say I'm very excited that this is the first time I've been cold out? So, um, not that I'm glad that you've hurt yourself today, but I'm glad that we've met and got this opportunity. big for your cut, but it's better than not covering enough, right? Okay. I'm just, uh, I'm testing the integrity of the band-aid. Thank you for being so patient.
continue to hold your arm up for me. That'd be great. I'm just gonna, uh, just gonna look at that for a second. I want to make sure that I'm uh, placing it right. Okay. I'm just gonna reach up here. Okay, it's one side. Glad you're feeling better. Unfortunately, my job is not done yet. I uh, I need to take, according to protocol, the protocol I have here. Um, I still need to make a sketch of the scene, and then I need to. Uh, well, first I need to make sure you're okay. So I'm gonna take, have a listen, and uh, do a quick set of um, some vitals minus blood pressure because I didn't bring my cuff. Uh, but we'll check on you and then I'm going to do a quick sketch of the scene and then we'll do some documentation and I, uh, I have a few questions to ask you so if you could sit with me through all of that, that would be great let me just pull the rest from my bag okay so my my stethoscope is still in the box how new I am. It's okay. It even has a replacement. Yeah. Okay. So, what I'm going to do is this is being kind of a traumatic ordeal and I want to make sure you're not going into shock so I'm gonna ask you to take a few deep breaths I'm gonna listen to your breathing rate right? and I'm gonna listen to your lungs okay, is that okay? okay I'm just gonna put those in my ears yeah okay so I'm gonna oh, I'll warm this up for you, sorry I'm gonna reach up and put this on your chest, dear. I want to take a deep breath for me. And again. And one more, please. Thank you. Okay, that's sounding pretty good. Doesn't look like you're doing too badly there. I'm just gonna take a quick listen to your heart here if you can stand nice and still for me. So it looks like you're you're gonna live. Um, which I'm very glad about because you're my first patient at the workplace, so I'm glad it wasn't something that was too severe. Okay. Um so yeah, now I'm gonna do a quick sketch of the scene. Um I'm gonna do this so that we can understand and review what happened here, and maybe we can prevent it in the future. So 
some pants. And I've got the travel laptop here for uh, our documentation. I'll just put that on the workbench there. Okay. patient first uh, workplace incident. still that would be great I'm just gonna have a look around you and see how this happened okay and and the cut was from from over there yeah that looks very sharp it looks very dangerous okay just show you for uh, documentation sake I gotta um, I need you just to sign and make sure that this is verified and accurate so I have the workplace that took place the incident um, here's the workplace here's you you're uh, bleeding from your from your arm from the cut and uh, this is the the workplace and there was something sharp and you cut yourself on the thing that was sharp so obviously you'd say out trade I imagine that's how it went down um and then time passed and this is, this is me arriving on the scene with my stethoscope and my backpack and my book that I'm now writing in it's a bookception I drew the book within the book. Mm -hmm. Does that sound accurate to you? Okay, so I'll give you the pen here. And uh, I'll just get you to sign this if that's okay. Thank you. Mm. Thank you. That's amazing. Perfect. feel better about this whole thing knowing that this is going so smoothly I hope you feel better too but it was my first time I was so nervous okay I'm just gonna pull my uh, laptop here and we're just gonna do a quick documentation of what went by and I can send that into head office and they'll review it Sorry, what time would you say this occurred? Okay. And, uh, 
how would you say you feel about the whole event? Are you happy? Upset? Angry? Do you feel like you'll sue the company for this event that occurred? Okay. Do you feel like this workplace injury requires you to take time off work? Do you feel like my service and response time was satisfy- satis- satisfactory? Satisfactory. Satisfactory for you today? Okay, yeah. Is there anything I could have improved on? We should stop there if that's okay. We should stop there. Um, I'm gonna put this away. I'll send that in. Oh, put it on the work bed there. Okay, well, uh, thank you for using the emergency work response team. Uh, the team just being me, but. Uh, sorry that this happened for you today. I hope you'll find that the procedure performed um, is satisfactory and, and helps heal you, and maybe you can continue your work today or continue the work in the future. So, thank you, and uh, thank you for putting up with me for my first day. <laughs>